Hi friends, I am Murli here. Let's create a simple routing application in Angular 8. So without wasting much time, let's start the coding straight away. I'm going to click git bash here. So I'm going to create an application called ng new angular route app. So let's start this. I think it will take some time. I will pass the video and come back once it is done. Okay, I'm back. The application is ready. Now let's uh, change the directory into the application. CD Angular routing app code space dot so it will open in Visual Studio Code Editor. Perfect. Now start the application. ng serve which will start our application. Meanwhile, let's see source app. We have a component here. We have a HTML here for the component. We have some default markup. Let's see how it actually works. So Okay, so let me remove everything which is there in component.html. I have did this. No, nothing is here. Perfect. Okay, the first step of uh, creating routing is we need to have a exclusive routing module.ts file or you can add those configuration in app module also but I prefer to have a separate file so app f1 routing dot module dot ts okay now I need to import root rectangular and import g module Oops. next I need to import angular root from here I need a router module. Okay, unroutes. Perfect. Now let me configure the ng module. So I need two inputs. And it exports as well. Need to have a comma here. That's why it's showing it. Up. Now export class app module. Okay. Now I need to define the. Um, <coughs> routes so before that let me have a couple of uh, components so let me have let me open new terminal ng generate component main component uh, skip test false so that oh, skip 
Just a sec. Oh, I need to give my phone a friend's gift. That's I think so. Perfect. Now I have main component. Let me create one more component. <coughs> two components one is main and one is about okay so what is this uh, let me declare this const routes routes it's a type of uh, routes this one it is an area of objects so path equal to mg so when nothing is there, the component I want to import is um, main component. Super. So this needs to be imported. Come on. Path. Colon. So if it is about, I want to import a component called about component. Perfect. Now this I need to pass it to for root over here. Perfect. My routing module is ready. So without further delay, let me go to app module. So let me import that app routing module I have imported I think it's fine so now go to this thing now I need to add a router outlet router outlet Everything is okay. I have an error. Click inject a router module. Children outlet object for children. What is the problem? Router outlet. Still later, static injector. Acha, it I might import. So my routing is working fine. Let me add bootstrap for this. So 
so get the bootstrap file copy now go to the index.js source index.js paste it here now get me the nav bar will take this now bar go to app component.html above the photo object I have tested this so I don't want the disabled URL right? so I don't want this URL as well so I want to go Perfect, fine. So I'll change the color BG primary. Okay. Hmm. Perfect. So about I need to add this router uh, link. Router link. Router link. They should be blank. And they should be out. When I click home, works fine. When I click about, about works fine. So, this how you can create simple. Uh, routing application if you want to add one more route i think we can do this i will show you mm. actually the script is not working here okay that doesn't be a matter contact so i have contact component is ready go to app routing so i need to add one more object path and component is the contact component perfect now go to app component have one more uh, line so over here connect perfect so I need to change the text Click contact about home. Perfect. So this is how we can create uh, a routing application. So just uh, I will quickly go through what and all I have did. I have created a file called app routing module.ts. I have imported these two from our core Angular. One is ng module and uh, router module and uh, routes from the angular router then i had a uh, variable which is array of objects contains the uh, routes then i have imported router module from here then in that uh, i have passed the routes whatever i have configured then i have exported same with the class name app router module then i went to app module.ts i have imported that uh, app router module in the import section that's it and uh, then i went to app component.html i used this particular markup router outlet basically it is showing where your route uh, routes content has to be loaded so then uh, i have a navigation menu here which contains router link directive which help us you know to navigate the relevant uh, directive uh, relevant routes so that's it. Thanks a lot for watching. If you feel this particular video is uh, useful to you, please share and comment. If you if you don't feel it is very silly, I know everything. There are some friends out there who don't know, who might be beginner, who might need some help in this particular place. So please do share or comment so that it might be helpful for them. Thanks a lot.